Yo, what are you saying? It's your boy Mars Chaps, I'm back in another video. And in today's video, we're going to be looking at kids explaining colours to a blind person. And no, I definitely did not steal this video idea from Cyrus. So yeah, let's get into the video. My room, it really like makes me go like, oh! <laughs> because it's super big. <laughs> oh my god, what the f what was that? That is something else entirely and there's no need to be screaming, but yeah. If the guy if I'm feeling like this, I'm pretty sure the guy next to her he's dying as well. Never seen anything ever. How bad are you blind? Like I'm so totally bad. blind. I am as blind as a bat. Educational note for any, you know, the young kids watching my channel, which I know there isn't, but bats aren't actually blind, that's just a myth. They actually see, like, I think they see as well as we do, but you know, at night time, you know, your eyes are useless, so they use echolocation to move around basically. So yeah, bats aren't actually blind. When you think of colors, what do you think of? How should I explain this? I don't know how to. I have to think. You, you see colors. Yeah. Well, you probably know that. I, I, well, I, 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 well, I don't see colors. You see colors. Well, he, yes, I do, actually. My guy right there just dug himself into a hole and he didn't even realize it. So you see colors. Yeah, the only color he's seen is black. I don't think I should have said that. Yeah, it's a bit of a sticky one. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying really hard. Some. Colors I never even seen before. Very true. It's not really a question that most people ask. Like, when you think of colors, what do you think? Like, I don't know. It's not really like the, that blue curtain that your English teacher asks you to explain, and she gives the connotation that it's depression that the author was feeling, or some type of rubbish like that. When people ask you of colors, what do you think? I don't know. Blue makes you happy. Red, you're angry. I don't know. Have you ever? I saw a color of a blueberry. And I've never seen anything ever. That's the whole point. Blue. What do you think of when you Blue, smell I think blue? of waddle. What oh, and my pillow. Your pillow? Like Steven's shirt. These kids are no help at all. Like, when he's trying to find out what does it feel like, this guy's just saying, oh, my pillow. Like, well, I know what a pillow feels like. I've never seen a pillow in my life. I mean, the guy's a bit, has a bit of an attitude. They're just little kids, and the guy's treating them, treating them like, like fools. The guy said, well, I haven't seen anything. That's the point. Well, he can't see my shirt. But, but, I mean, like, his... But, but, no, he can't see. I can't see that, but what sound do you think when you think of what? Um, um, and speaking of blue, your pants are blue. Mm -hmm. Well, jeans. So, the only thing that they've provided in this situation is more questions for the kid and ear rape, really and truly. Like, the first kid just blew his ears off and the others are just doing some kumbaya malo type of meditation thing going on there. I mean, it really does, doesn't help that she points out that his jeans are blue. Like, yeah, his jeans are blue. It doesn't, that's not the point. So what about red? Red is like fire and like madness. Oh, I think red could like explosion. Boom! What would red be? reminds me of blood. I Pain. Guess. Blood. Blood. You know, I think we all relate to this little kid right here. You know, the first kid that said red is like an explosion. You know, fiery madness. We we're thinking, yes, you're okay. But the, the next kid said it's blood. You know, blood just stabbing out. Just stabbing out your enemies, you know, just let the blood of the innocents rinse the streets. This kid is gonna grow up to be a mass murderer. Blood? Oh yeah. Like, oh, that's, I, that. Oh yeah. Okay, rinse that, rinse that. Is This is the kid that's gonna be a mass murderer. How can you say blood? She's like, yeah, heck yeah. <laughs> I don't even know, really and truly, I, I don't know. I'm sorry, woo, okay. What, what's, what's the sound that you associate with red? What's the middle of the road color? I feel like a warm color or a warm or orange. cool. Orange. Orange. Yeah, no, that is bias. Orange is not a warm color. Just saying that because of ginger. And I don't hate the gingers. It's just, if you're, if you're saying like a, a calm, warm color, it should be red. It should be the madness and the fiery depths of hell. 
Actually, I don't, I don't, I don't know what consumed me. I'm sorry about that. Orange or fruits. My favorite color is dark orange. Dark orange. Because it's so dark. Why is called dark orange? Whoa, 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 whoa! Do we have this kid saying that that he's definitely on some of that orange? He's definitely hyped up on that citrus acid. The way how this guy's jumping up and down. That see the way how he sounded, like like the A1, some A1 steak sauce that he's drinking. The maddest lad in the tavern. Let's find the orange. Okay, I can find it easy. Okay. Apple, uh, apple, Very strawberry. <laughs> what about uh, what about green? Well, um, green imagine? is like happy and sometimes disgusting. How is green happy and disgusting? Look, look at the Hulk. He's not happy. The, the whole premise of his power is that he's not happy. He's anxious, scared, and ang angry. Am I missing something here? I think I am. I really do think I'm missing something here. Oh, what's that? Ew, broccoli! <laughs> Boogers! Boogers? <laughs> if somebody like farted or something. <laughs> <laughs> that was what I was going to Green, say. huh? <laughs> yeah. But these guys really think life is a cartoon. You know, get your diary of a wimpy kid ass just out of here, really and chilly. Just, just get out of here. Green is rotten. Green makes I me feel like a zombie. Ooh, a zombie, huh? Okay, I retract my earlier statements. This kid is definitely the guy who's gonna cause the zombie end of the world apocalypse. Forget that 2012 movie. This is gonna be the day after tomorrow. There's none um, white, of course, because we can't see white. And no, we no can't black. see white. Like, we can see white. Did he say he can't see white? No, yeah. no, we can't see white in a rainbow. Okay, this kid is definitely on something. You can't see white, what well, we can see white, like the, the wall behind us is white, you can see black. He said, no, you can't see white in a rainbow. Of course you're not gonna see white in a rainbow. It's like, what, seven colors in a rainbow? Oh, Cobaleno, wait, I'm not Italian. Why did I say that? No, but anyway, yeah, you don't, you can't see white because there's no white in a rainbow. Actually, she is onto something there. I'm not gonna judge her. You can't see white because it's not in a rainbow. But at the same time, you wouldn't really be seeing white because it's not supposed to be in a rainbow. I think brown has the color that I use for when I don't like people. And why is brown a mean color? Is it because it reminds you of poop? <laughs> yes, racism to its finest extent. Yes, us brown people, we look like poo, really, we look like shit. That, that, that's, that's the whole premise of our existence. And that's how it's all boiled down to. Thanks to the guy who can't see colours, we have seen our true colours. We are shit. <laughs> and then yellow would be like the kid who can, who's a good kid but can never sit still like, oh hey, how are you doing? Like yellow, psh, light. I mean, yeah, yellow is also to describe the kid who Naruto runs or the kid who thinks he can go Super Saiyan. Those are the kids you need to stay away from. Those are the kids that will cause society to fall one day. Sounds like when you like, like when a box is like tumbling off a hill or something. What would you associate like Taylor Swift color? I know. Bright, peppy, girlish pink. Ooh. Not so bad. <laughs> you need to get this kid out of the room. Cause she's doing something else. She's on some different type of vibe. She must be on some of that, you know, some of that citric <laughs> acid type thing that that other kid was on. Unicorns exploding in my mouth. <laughs> oh my god. Unicorns exploding in your mouth. Wait, what? I learn something new every day. If you like this video, make sure you like and you comment down below what I did right, comment down below what I did wrong, and I'll change that in the next video. If it's the first time you've seen my ugly mug on your screen, make sure you like and you subscribe. Hit the notification bell to get notified if ever or whenever I post. And probably the next video on this channel, I'll do something different. The commentary and story time something, but I'm gonna add something new to the mix. Maybe someone else will be coming on the channel, we don't know. But I'll see you in the next video. In a bit. She got me going psycho. She got me going down, down, down. Got me living on a tightrope. She got me going. Room. She was glaring me down. And she kept on asking me. Actually demanding that I told her that I was the one who took Zoom's money and I knew I didn't take his money but after a fully grown adult is hammering down an eight year old 
um the eight-year-old is gonna break finally break and she said if you say that you're the one who took his money nothing will happen to you everything will be fine